Okay, we're here at the Woodbine Ecology Center uh, near Sedalia, Colorado. Yeah, where we've been doing a, a five-day edible forest garden with a special emphasis on decolonizing the diet and bringing back traditional and native foods uh, to the indigenous community. So right here we have the uh, annual vegetable garden, including an indigenous garden with corn and beans and squash and other traditional crops. Um, it's very windy. And uh, today we planted a small area of uh, a sort of all-native hedgerow. The first thing to point out is that we, we really dug into the hillside and uh, created a, a basin and berm system or a swale where there's this part in here is a nice uh, uh, a bowl for collecting rainwater and, and holding snow. And then we have a berm, uh, which is actually supported by some, uh, some logs and stones underneath as well. Uh, the berm has been planted out to um, native, uh, primarily nitrogen-fixing species to hold it in place and to, uh, to build soil there. We've got some bunch of native lupins, um, false indigo. Buffalo berry, um, and then on the other side are some New Mexican locusts. We also have in here a few um, very tiny specimens of balsam root sunflower, which is uh, an edible uh, native plant that also attracts beneficial insects. So then heading back to the, to the berm. We've got a, a, a diversity of native uh, berry crops. We have, uh, for here is uh, service berry or Saskatoon. Um, we have uh, the golden currant. We have some chokeless choke cherries. side we've got another golden current and a couple of uh, improved American hazelnuts. These are those New Mexican locusts over here on the berm with lupins and other things. So this is uh, the idea here in the long term is that the nitrogen fixing species will serve as a, as a living hedgerow on the berm They'll be coppiced and used as mulch to improve the soil uh, in the bed. We also did a lot of sheet mulching in here. There's about eight inches of good soil building sheet mulch in these basins. So the, the nitrogen fixing species will be a hedge that will catch snow, which is where a lot of the precipitation here comes to help it to melt down. Uh, they'll stabilize the berm and help with rainwater capture, and they'll be chopped and use this coppice uh, mulch to improve the soil in here. This uh, planting of, of uh, native uh, fruiting and, and uh, producing shrubs uh, will also serve as a nursery for planting out uh, the rest of the site, which is a total of 62 acres. So there's plenty of plenty of that to plant out. So this is the beginning of something very exciting here at Woodbine.